Hi, uh, today I want to show you how to add uh, static security testing for REST APIs um, into your Bitbucket pipelines. So here's my sample Bitbucket project. It has a bunch of um, REST APIs. Here are some definitions of the REST APIs in Open API format in JSON and YAML. Um, so that's, that's a good project to, to demonstrate how, how that works. So uh, let me open my Bitbucket pipelines file. Um, that's the definition of my pipe and uh, I will click edit and I want to add another step. Uh, the security uh, audit um, uh, task uh, pipe comes from foot to crunch fairly easy to find it and um, here's what we need to add um, but there's a prerequisite uh, one mandatory uh, a parameter which is um, an API token for the 42 crunch platform. Um, so here's how I will need to call it. Um, and so let me start by actually going to the um, repository settings. Variables. Let me add that variable. And so the value I need to take from the 42 crunch API security platform, um, you can get a free account from there by going to the platform 42 crunch.com slash register. Uh, I already have an account, so I'll go and just get the API token from it. I'll remove the one from previous demo. Uh, so let me create a new token. And I'll need to give it rise to the security audit, but also to list resources and, and delete resources so it can recreate reports. So I've copied my token. I go here, paste it, make it secured so no one can access it. Here we have it. Now we can go back to source. Open my pipeline definition for editing. Find again that extension from Forge to Crunch. And just copy the code. That's the easiest thing that I can do. I can obviously go and add other variables, like I can customize the, the kind of API collections that it creates. I can customize the minimal uh, score threshold uh, that is being used to define if an API is secure or not. For now, let's just keep it simple. Here we go. Let's commit it. Add REST API test. Now I made the change. Um, obviously, right now I've just modified the pipeline, but again, with any change, any new API, uh, REST API added or modified, uh, there will be a change in the pipeline. So let me go back to the pipeline. Here it is in progress without changes. And you can see that it actually found all the open API definitions and uh, generated some reports for them uh, and provided link for the reports and, and so on. Uh, and also you can see that the extension is using uh, Bitbucket code insights, so it generates um, a report here as well. So you can look at the at the log and see all the open API files that it found and their scores and whether they passed or not. Or you can get into this report here and again you'll see all the open API files that it found. And uh, for any of them you can see the summary, but you can also uh, click and go into the file or click this link 
and that opens the report right in the foot to crunch platform and this is a much more detailed report it not only gives you the score it gives you the highest priority issues that it found and also gives you all the all the issues that it found you know authentication authorization transport data validation anything that's wrong with the uh, with the open api uh, format and, and so on and so you can go through these and you can also go for any of them you can get into the details of where they are in the file and, and see information on how to fix it with the uh, description of the issue example of how it looks like um, possible exploit scenario the ways to remediate and, and so on so it's a very very um, useful tool to check all your open api files um, and find all the issues uh, in them have them fixed and make sure that no uh, rest api vulnerabilities ever get through your uh, bitbucket pipeline again this is a very useful extension from foot to crunch give it a try thank you